evening. Sarawak has banned the import of live pigs and pork products from European countries and China since December 26 due to the outbreak of the African Swine Fever, ASF, in these countries. State Department of Veterinary Services Deputy Director Dr. Stephen Gabriel said, pork products and all means of processing are included in this ban except for canned pork products as they are produced under very high temperature. Dr. Gabriel said his department would continue to check on shops and other premises to ascertain that these pork products were not sold to the public. Deputy Minister of Agriculture and Agro-Based Industry Sim C. Zin believed with the new discovery and new development, the ministry will enlarge the ban on pork products to protect our country from ASF. The body of a man with stab wounds was found in Naka near Sungai Petani, Kedah, early this morning. Kuala Muda Police Deputy Chief Superintendent Sazali Adam said the man, identified as A. Muniandi, 41 years old, was found in the driver's seat of a white MPV near the night market site of Taman Bandar Baru. He said a member of the public who was on patrol duty came across the body in the car and contacted the Badung police station at 4.15 a.m. The body has been sent to the Sultanah Bahia Hospital in Alusta and the motive behind the murder is still being investigated. India will send a three-member team into space for up to a week when it launches its first manned mission expected in 2022. According to a government statement, Indian ministers approved $1.4 billion to provide technology and infrastructure for the program. The amount would make India one of the cheapest manned space programs and the country will become the fourth nation after Russia, the United States and China to to send a main mission into space. The government has stated that space flights will boost the economy, generate jobs and enhance capabilities in areas such as medicine, agriculture and fighting pollution. New Delhi is competing with other international players for a greater share of the satellite market and hopes its low-cost space program will bear an advantage. That is all the updates at 8. I'm Shira Abang Manso for TV Sarawak, anytime, anywhere.